Hey guys, I'm LB, and today where we would normally play a Rectorox map, we are instead going to play a map that Rectorox played, called Path of No Return by Beneficial. Escape the chamber along the Path of No Return, and return, and return. Alright, Rectorox gave it a 7.5 out of 10, let's go see what this thing has got for us. So already got my favorite theme. Let's see... this is... death. Yes, mostly death. We have a button here that will appear when we do something up there, or maybe this is the thing to trigger the button? One of these is the input and one's the output, I think... I can't remember which way that- that- that works. I think this is the... this is the output and that's the input? Yeah, okay, so yeah, so... We need to put something on this button to get this button to do something up there. This looks... familiar. I feel like I might have seen somebody play this already, because I- I- I saw that Rectorox had uploaded this and added it to my watch later, but I didn't actually watch it. But I might have seen somebody else watch this and play this. Ah, it might have been Knock. Alright, well whatever, that's fine. We'll still play it anyway. <laughs> Does a light bridge? Really? Why would I want that? Okay. We have another area over here with a button that we can't get to right now. Maybe this is a light bridge is for? Oh wait, what's this? I don't really know what I'm doing here. <laughs> Whee! Oh, I wanted to land on top of that, oh well. Okay, what does this do? This is a way to go back. Can we do this at all? Hey, look at that, we can. So what avail? I have no idea what I'm doing right now. This place is so cluttered, I can't- I can't tell where I'm supposed to go or what I'm supposed to do. Also, look at this! <laughs> Instead of just making it, like, sideways right here, they chose to- to do it like this so that you can't- can't shoot back there, even though you can. You can still shoot back there anyway, so you did it wrong. You did it wrong, but I'll- I'll do it the way you want me to do it. What does this do? Oh, we finally have a cube. And this disables the death girl temporarily. Wait, what? Oh. That... Oh, is this what we want the light bridge for, then? Oh, that's why they did it this way! Oh, oh, but brilliant, brilliant, that's- that's brilliant. 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 The sky was brillig. Okay, let me- how did I... I did something like this, right? There we go. I just want to save time. What is up with this? Is this supposed to look like that when it's off? That's strange. Alright, let's, uh... Let's get this light bridge going again. There we go. Ta-da! Alright, so... We have our cube now. We put it here. And that disables the fizzler. Is there... A reason that we'd want to do it like oh okay. <laughs> oh wow. I I saw that coming and uh I don't know why I did that. That was really dumb of me. Alright, let's go through all this uh mumbo jumbo again. You know, I was just talking about a one-way barrier with, uh, Rector Rocks. And this sort of works as a one-way barrier, but it clears your portals. So, there's that. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm facepalming right now. Oh man. You know, I think I know what it is. It's because I watched Nock play this first, and I've inherited his traits. <laughs> just kidding, Nock, I'm just kidding. Oh, man. But, yeah, this- I am- I'm flustered. I don't know if you noticed last episode yesterday, but... 
I'm- I'm kinda flustered. I just got done playing Rebirth. And, uh, oh my goodness. I'm still shaking from that. That was, uh, quite something. Why can you pick up some of these? That's so weird. Alright, whatever. Okay, so we do this. Back here. And, uh... Just go ahead and start the cube spawning, right? That's not too much else I can do. One of these buttons did it, I don't care. Alright. Do that. Then that. Oh, and that's the other thing else. I've been t talking with Nock about, you know, specifically using one portal color as input and the other as output. And then you only have to break the rule oca occasionally. I use, uh, black and blue for input in orange and green for output. Alright, let's quick save. There. I saved. <laughs> Alright, that disables the fizzler. This does this. And then we can just pull the cube out. Save. Why did it aim assist to the... Like it... Did I do that, or...? This... That has... that's... that's... It's like there's two aim assists there. It's weird. Alright, whatever. Okay, that time I did not hit the fizzler and kill myself. Or not kill myself, but clear my portals. Hey, we have the cube, so now we can press the button. And that's permanent, right? Yep, okay, we don't need the cube anymore. But we can do it for this, I guess. Hey, look at that, because of the aim assist. So what I want to do, is I want to reverse my- my method here, so that way I can get the light bridge... ...be on my input portal. And there! Now the light bridge is on input portal, and my output portal is where the light bridge comes out. So the question is, where do we actually want to use it? Okay, that was unexpected. It wasn't really... Wasn't- how- wait, how high does this send me? Potentially... I'd have to... be really good, though. And I only have a limited time to do it in. And it's not gonna work anyway. Whatever. <laughs> it was worth a shot. I wouldn't be able to walk over fast enough. There is that, but this doesn't shoot me upward. Let's look over here again. Don't get killed by this. I wanted to snap that in half or whatever. Alright, so we can put the cube up here. Oh, I'm assuming... Really? How? Oh, duh. Duh, duh, duh. Alright, so, we gotta get the cube. Why is this a one-way deal? <laughs> you know, the one downside to this, uh, this style, even though I really like it, is that it does make things very cluttered, and it's hard to see what's going on everywhere. Okay, so what we gotta do... I already messed it up. <laughs> Let's see... Let me just- let me just clear my portals real quick. There we go. Cause I wanna have the light bridge on my input portal. Input. Pull this through. Save. And continue. Oh, that finally broke it. That little... rubble. And we put the cube here, and we get to find out what this button over here does. And yeah, this is, uh, I guess that's just a side effect of Vmod or something, because it's only supposed to look like that when it's turned on. <laughs> uh... 
so, I got a jump port right at the last second. I was trying to avoid doing that, but whatever. It's okay. I don't mind. Run, 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 run! Oh, okay, I would've made it by walking that time. Oh, that makes that permanent! That's an- okay, that's an ore gate then. Alright. Now to that... that... Oh, so we can... okay. So we probably still wanna... Probably still wanna get the cube out of here, right? I guess it doesn't really matter too much. Oh, I know what I can do. That actually worked. Impressive. Alright, save. And continue. Let's go down over here. Press this button. Oh. Okay. Why would I want that? Not- Oh, okay, that's a shortcut. Okay, right, duh. Of course it is. Alright, so now... We can get over... What did that button? Oh, right, yeah, okay. Can get over here, and where does all... Oh no, that's just... Okay. What? X and dot. Where are X and dot? Oh! I didn't even see this spot here. So once we're over here, where do we want to go? Where are X and Dot? I don't remember seeing them anywhere. Oh, they're inside! What? Oh, wait, no. How would... Oh! I can use the faith plate as a timer. If I can get the cube over it... ish. Eh, good enough. Alright, so then... Faith plate will... okay. That's actually pretty clever. I didn't... I wanted to jump over that fizzler just in case it fizzled. Okay, so what we're gonna do... is this. Hey! Did it! Awesome. Cool stuff. Oh, and that's it. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. That last part, honestly, was the best part. The, the rest of the puzzle... I'm not much a fan of the rest of the puzzle. That was kind of just... messy. But that last part, I have to admit, was cool. So I'll, go, I'll give it a thumbs up. Because if it was just that last part on its own, I would have thumbed it up, I guess. Maybe. <laughs> Well guys, as always, thank you for watching, I really appreciate it. You can show your appreciation with the two buttons below the video that look like these ones here. And I will see you all in the next episode. Goodbye!